Hey, this is Zach. Welcome to Web3 Reviews. Thank you for being with us. Today is Monday, August 12th, and we're going to be talking about Gala Music. Remember that none of this is financial advice. We're going to start this off listening to a piece from Snoop Dogg. Let's go. Freeman got to get their shit together, because I don't understand how the fuck you get paid off of that shit. I mean, can somebody explain to me how you can get a billion streams and not get a million dollars? That shit don't make sense to me. Like, I don't know who the fuck running the streaming industry, if you in here or not. <laughs> But nigga, you need to give us some information on how the fuck to track this money down. Because one plus one ain't adding up to two. And I have to say it, because that's the main gripe with a lot of us artists is that we do major numbers with streams and this shit, but it don't add up to the money. Like, what the fuck is the money? When I first came out, my records would sell based off of physical. If you sold a million copies, that means if $9.99, $9 million, you get this percentage, that's what it is. So if I sell how many streams, how much money do I get? It's not being translated and it's not working for the artist right now. And I just want to speak to that in yeah, the no, music industry. Talk. like. That's fucked up. And we need to find a way to figure that out. The same way the writers are figuring out, the writers are striking because streaming. They can't get paid. Because when it's on the platform, it's not like in the box office. In the box office, if it does all these numbers, you may get a up. Oh, it did this many, here's another check. But on streaming, you got 300,000 hours that somebody watched your movie. Where's the money? And I know I'm going off a script right now, but fuck it. This is business. You know what I'm saying? This is a room full of business people, and somebody may hear this and be able to do something about it so that way the next artist don't have to struggle or cry or try to figure out how to get to his money because some of these artists are streaming millions and millions and millions and millions of fucking streams and they don't got no millions of dollars in their pocket so i just yeah. wanted to say that yeah what are you doing with gala in the space gala games gala music that's my partners those are my people they stepped up to the plate they um really was there for me on this death row play they've been there there for me on all things web three as far as with my artists and me and my music and my catalog I just love working with them because they're like a high-end version of what I'm doing on OpenSea. What I'm doing on OpenSea right now is just mixtape style music, but the things that I do with Gala will be project-based, NFT-based storylines. We're building the Death Row NOD. We're doing all types of things that just make this shit go to a whole nother level. Gala Games, Gala Music, Death Row Records. There it is. I'd love to hear it from Snoop. There's a problem in the music industry, and there's a solution being Gala Music, blockchain music accountability you know how many streams you got and you know how much money you're supposed to earn per stream looking at snoop dogg's gala music page here we see that he's got a bunch of songs still for sale with only one track sold out go ahead and get yourself some snoop dogg songs and start earning with snoop here we go we got a message from taco about the songs that have been dropping so taco says that on friday they had Braden the young special they had hope richardson in my room they had marty grimes the for you remix they had disco fries times tiffany I think we're alone now. And then today, on Monday, we have Neil Degas, Beginning of the End. We have Little Extra, Avis. We have Northwest Stories, Happy Camper. And we have Marzetti, Coming Over. Looking at Northwest Stories' artist page here, we see that Northwest Stories consist of Adam and RJ, both husbands, fathers, and followers of Jesus Christ. Adam and RJ were fans of each other's work before they officially met at the beginning of 2021. When Adam moved to the same city as RJ and they started working together on various projects, they decided to form Northwest Stories. Now here they are on Gala Music. They're a folk band, folk and pop, they call themselves. Their first song, Happy Camper, is up for sale today. Go get yourself a copy, show them some support. Let's look at the top 25 songs today. The number one track on the charts today is Flashback by Six Bucks. Number two, This Moment, Rye Cat. Number three, Deuce Ex Machina. WVM. Number four, Only Memories, Leap Year. Number five, Bossy 2, Serafa. Number six, In My Room, Hope Richardson. Number seven, Her Shadow, Cypress. Number eight, Daydreaming, No Worries. Number nine, Hustle Culture, Six Bucks. Number 10, Blood, WVM. Number 11, Virgin Glitch, Kudo Dis. Number 12, Street Life, Snoop Dogg, featuring Tupac. Number 13, Shooting Stars, Puff Pass. Number 14, Aliens Are Here, Billy Rax. Number 15, Outworld, SS. Number 16, Bodega, Razor. Number 17, Some Kind of Way, Six Bucks. Number 18, Alien Targets, Billy Rax. Number 19, Kindred Spirit, The Lore. Number 20, All, Serafa. Number 21, Here I Stand, Darren Claxton. Number 22, Streben Nock Oben, Kuadis. Number 23, What Am I Doing Here, LH. Number 24, Reflection, Cypress. Number 25, Operation by Kiki Dexter. So that is the top 25 songs on the charts today. We have new artist Northwest Stories. And then we look at the chart for Gala Music and we'll see that we are sitting at three cents, holding it down strong. This past week we went down and we came back up. We went down and touched 2.7 cents this week and now we're back up to three cents. We're pretty much stabilized at three and we touched an all time low of 2.7. In my eyes, this is extremely bullish. 
you've had a token that's been out for about one year. The bull run is about to happen. We've already hit an all-time low. We have a ton of momentum, songs, artists, people circling the problem of what's going on in the music industry. Big things are coming to Gala Music. In my eyes, this is the token in the music space for blockchain. Audius, Opium, Bybit. You know, to me, it's just Gala Music. So tell me what you think. Thank you all for being with us. Until next time.